Hey guys, um, so let me tell you something about my bike. Um, back in May, I did open up the top end. Not the top end, but just the top uh, head cover to the front cylinder. Because um, I was getting a tapping, knocking void, knock, knocking sound in the front cylinder. And um, every time when I hear something like that, it, it, it sounded like it's the valves so I'm like I need to check the adjustments to my valves and once I got opening this top cover um, I did not know that this new bike has hydraulic um, hydraulic cam chain tensioner so like you really don't need to do any adjustment or maintenance on you know gapping your valves and stuff like that because um, this is a hydraulic cam, cam chain tensioner um, but there is something that you do do um, with like a dial gauge indicator. Um, you measure your camshaft lobes and then you just uh, install the right shims. There's a specification for doing all that and I did that and I was like maybe um, that's what it needed. So I ended up doing that. I put the, the engine cover back on, the engine back on the bike. Um, then afterwards, I was, it sounded a little bit better, but I was still getting that tapping sound. And I was like, what the fuck? Like, I don't know. I was like, you got to be kidding me. There's something else. And then I I was just thinking like, okay, how this engine works. It's a four stroke. Um, and then I was like, you know what? Maybe it's the cam chain. Maybe the cam chain, the chain is stretched or it could be the tensioner somehow. So... I was like, 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 and it's weird because that tapping sound, like sometimes I would hear it, sometimes I wouldn't. And, um, but like throughout the last days of writing it, like it, it was actually getting worse and worse. And I was like, I'm like, I need to like, besides the, 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 uh, gasket, uh, the blown head gasket, I was like, I need to check this too. So I'm going to show you something right now. So right here, I'm just inspecting that area of, you know, the engine parts in my bike. Like you can see the, the camshaft, camshaft sprocket, um, the cam chain, and the this is the, the, the hydraulic tensioners, and this is uh, another like cam chain guide. Um, so I was inspecting it. You know, I was like, you know what? Maybe I do need a new chain. So like I even ordered a new chain. I'm like I'm just gonna get it. It wasn't. It, it didn't even cost that much. So I'm like I'm just gonna get it. And then so like yes night last night I um took my whole top end apart from my uh my engine. And so like I was just also looking up parts on eBay. Like here is someone selling a cam chain tensioner so I was like maybe I just need a an, another cam chain tensioner so I have my this is a cam chain tensioner to the front cylinder and then like I remember as I was inspecting the parts right here and then okay I'm I was studying that and then I looked over here and I was like something is not right and I'm just looking at it and then I remember when I was taking uh both of my my top end off like you I have to install this pin when I installed this pin it was easy to install on the rear uh tensioner it was really hard to like stick it through and then I'm like one of these is off and so right now I'm inspecting a closer and I was like no fucking way there's supposed to be a spring from here to here and like I checked the bag and I'm sure um when I when this comes out like that spring like I, like you're not even supposed to touch it because this whole mechanism just comes off the the cylinder and I was like it's supposed to be right here, and if you can see right here at the parts diagram, spring right here, spring right here. And so I was like, okay, 
Let me check my my rear tensioner. So this is the the rear one. That pin is there, which is really it was really hard to um, uh, put through and check that out. See, there's that spring right here. Yep, that's the spring that's missing on the front one. So, this was the result of my, my ticking sound on the front cylinder. My, the, the tensioner wasn't working properly, so that cam chain was loose and was probably like just hitting every side walls to, to whatever it, the path of it was and just making that sound and... And yeah, that's, this is how it's supposed to look with that spring on there. And the biggest question is, where is the spring to this? Um, like, I'm just looking at this one and like springs are actually really hard to, to take out and to install. So I, I really don't know if the previous owner or whoever did an engine rebuild like they probably took out the spring and forgot to put it back on or they bought uh they bought this tensioner and it they didn't know and they just installed it without even checking properly and installed it without a spring i'm really hoping that spring is not in the engine but i mean i i really i mean i'm gonna be checking like um the bottom end of the engine but um when this bike was running like i there wasn't any other issues besides i mean the sound and the and um that uh coolant leaking but um i really don't know what happened to that spring and it's so fucking crazy like yeah that's why i was getting that sound so yeah